Hello Libra, welcome to your love reading, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Let's see what messages will show up for you today. Libra, this is a collective love message for your sign. So please take it how it resonates and what resonates for your overall situation. Let's see. What do we have for Libra? Okay. Eight of Cups, the Wood of Fortune, Knight of Swords, the Lovers, Five of Cups, Two of Cups, Six of Swords, Four of Swords. Overall energy for this part of the reading, we have the Moon. So Libra, you might be dealing with Pisces, I have Cancerian energy, Gemini, Sagittarius, Aquarius, Taurus, Scorpio, Leo. Well, we are connecting this reading for you with someone, Lib Libra, who, who is walking away from their past. This is someone who's closing a certain chapter in their life that really made them very, very disappointed. For some of you, this is someone it's like a long distance situationship, connection with the Eight of Cups, Wheel of Fortune, the Six of Cups. Those cards might indicate um, that there is a physical distance between the two of you. It doesn't have to be the case though for all of you. But Eight of Cups with the Five of Pentacles suggests here that this person is walking away from something that doesn't make them happy anymore. With the Five of Cups, this person has been thinking a lot about this. There is something here about the past that they been uh, very much focused on but at the moment it's like because they met you they want to have a fresh start here Libra with the will of fortune knight of swords and the lovers this is someone who wants this connection it feels like this person is gaining their courage they want to chase you with the knight of swords they want to talk about this they feel that there is a need to talk about certain things here but mainly that Knight of Swords here is heading towards those lovers. So this is someone who really wants this connection to evolve into something really, really serious and profound. Wheel of Fortune. Yeah, this is someone who doesn't want to lose an opportunity with you. Um, they feel like <laughs> they won a lottery here. And we have this Two of Cups here with the Wheel of Fortune. You know, this person... This person, Libra, has feelings for you. They want this connection. This is someone who wants to maybe get to know you better. If it's a new person or if it's a current relation, relationship or connection, they want you. They want this. Mm -mm. With the Six of Swords and Four of Swords, it's like this person wants to move on with you towards the future. And Four of Swords here... There is something here about you having that very kind of healing impact on this connection. Because this is someone here who is healing from sort of some sort of um, disappointment that happened in their past. But because of you, it's, it's much easier. It's much smoother. It's, 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 it's more gentle. This person is in love with you, Libra. They want relationship. They want to be with you. And they won't give up on this because with the Knight of Swords, this person is going towards you. The Moon. I feel that they are, you know, very deep in their emotions. They might be quite emotional at the moment. But there is something here also about uncertainty, doubt. Maybe you have doubts because you don't know fully what to expect from that connection, from this connection. Let's see. Could you please show me this person's feelings towards Libra? Knight of Pentacles. Nine of Wands, 
Seven of Wands and the Temperance, Queen of Swords as an overall energy. So you might be dealing with Sagittarius. Knight of Pentacles. This is someone who has very stable feelings for you. Knight of Pentacles is a very stable energy and also the slowest moving knight. It feels here that you have someone who wants to stay. They are going nowhere. Nine of Wands with the Seven of Wands with the Temperance. There is something here about this person wanting to take things slowly. But at the same time, they want to rush into things with you. <laughs> you didn't care with someone who has trust issues because of the past. Seven of Wands. Um, I'm getting here very strongly. Someone who in the past was trying to prove that they care, but it's like the other person from their past didn't acknowledge that. However, this individual here, Libra, they, they want to prove it to you that they care. They do have trust issues, but they care a lot about you and this connection. With the temperance, there is something here about divine timing, patience, and also this person here wants, it's like they don't want a roller coaster. This person wants to have quiet, stable, kind of, I don't know how to say it, harmonious relationship. This is someone who's not interested in, I mean, so far in this reading, uh, based on this, those cards, feels like they are not interested in any drama. Mm -hmm. And they do have very strong feelings for you, but those feelings are also quite, you know, I feel this person really trying to ma maintain balance. Stability is very important for this individual. Queen of Swords. They see you as someone here, Libra, who knows, who knows exactly what you want. You know, you, this is a very assertive energy. I feel this person deep inside is dreaming. I was like wishing, I wish I could have that assertiveness, if I can say it that way, as Libra has. If I could just, you know, it's, I feel this person is admiring you. Could you please show me this person's actions towards Libra in the near future, immediate future? Three of Cups, Six of Pentacles, Nine of Cups, the Magician, Seven of Pentacles, nice. So Libra, you might be dealing with Gemini, Virgo. Cross watches the roles can be reversed. And also Libra, if I haven't mentioned your person, sign of Zodiac, but you resonate with this reading, that's your message, okay? Six of Wands overall energy. Well, you can expect here, Libra, that this person is going to gi start giving you more and more attention. Three of Cups with the Six of Pentacles. I'm getting here very strongly that they will they will come here with initiative in the near future, immediate future to spend. It's like they would like to spend more time with you for some of you. It's like this person will invite you to some sort of party gathering or event or maybe even on a date or just to, you know, spend some time, like go for a coffee or something like this. But Three of Cups suggests here that you are going, you are going to spend a very nice time with this person. Six of Pentacles, you will see this person open up more to you, sharing more. Uh, things with you in a sense you know the experiences you you will find yourself having um, long conversations with this person nine of cups with the magician this is a dream come true combination of cards mm -hmm. N magician also it's communication nine of cups communication that brings fulfillment happiness um, personal satisfaction you know I feel that you know you that there are it feels like good times are on the horizon here, Libra. I see this person really focusing on you. And it's like they will try to do everything, I feel, to kind of um, to let you know that they care. I feel that this time really will bring um, fulfillment. 
with the Nine of Cups and the Magician uh, to your life. Seven of Pentacles, this is someone who will show you that they are invested. Also with the Magician, I see a lot of communication. It's like, you know, this person is going to send you a message like a first thing in the morning saying hello or good morning, ha have a great day. And they might be the last one saying good night, you know. But this is like a long term, like a solid communication that's going to last for a quite some time. I mean, for a long time with the Seven of Pentacles. Really, Seven of Pentacles here suggests that this person is very much invested. They will let you know that. And they are going nowhere, essentially, Libra. Six of Wands, they, they, they are going to give you lots of attention. So it feels here for some of you within a week, two weeks. Uh, something here will make you very, very happy. <laughs> Let's see. Show me the outcome. Show me the outcome. Queen of Five of Swords, Queen of Pentacles, Five of Wands. Okay, with the Page of Wands as an overall energy. Page of Wands as an overall energy here suggests that message is going to arrive. Um, you can expect that this person is going to reach out to you very, very soon. Five of Swords, Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Wands. Here is the thing. This person is going to open up more to you. They will start to open up more to you, share more with you. And uh, Libra, it might be a case here that at some point, this person will start talking a lot about their ex. Okay. And... Um, this is what I am getting here. I'm seeing you being very classy about this whole situation. You know, you you sitting at your throne, you keeping your <laughs> head very, very high. Um, you're being very diplomatic about this whole situation. But um, I feel that with the five of swords, it's like you might be feeling at some point that this person might be, that they are not fully detached from their past, that they are not fully sincere with you, you know. There is this element of manipulation. It's like I feel that you don't want to be someone's therapist. And at some point it might feel like, like that when this person will start talking a lot about their experiencing experiences with their past, with their past partner or regarding their past. And it's like you'll be sitting there listening to them and might be seeing, might be thinking like, I don't really want to talk about this. I want to focus on us. And this Five of Swords, it's more about, I feel you don't want to be played, obviously, but it's like, I don't want to be someone's therapist. I don't want to just this person to come and just talk and, you know, unload the, all those things that happened in the past. I do want to share. I feel that you do want to share experiences, but it, you don't want this past situation to be a main point within regarding this connection like a vocal point regarding this connection i don't feel you are interested in this i feel that it can be quite frustrating and it can be quite um yeah let's say frustrating so what i am getting here that when it comes to the outcome and we're talking about near future immediate future you will hear you might hear something here about the past and about something to do with their past um, ex-partner okay and you might not fully kind of you know like it let's say it that way I need to be honest with you but um, I'm seeing you you know keeping your heart uh, keeping your head very very high and being very diplomatic about this whole situation but this person has to be aware that they need to read the room and they need to um, they need to recognize that you know not not all the time it's like they need to they need to know where to stop talking about the past 
because that can create self-sabotage kind of situation. It doesn't have to be, you know, energy is fluid. But based on this reading, I feel that it's like I'm getting here that, yes, you'll be spending fantastic time with this person, you'll be very happy, but because they will start open, opening up more to you, it feels very strongly here, Libra, that this person might be talking about their ex, and it's like, uh, you might not fully like it. If that's the case, I feel that, you know, at some point um, with this Page of Wands, you might say something here in a very diplomatic way, very diplomatic way. But in general, I see here very strongly, Libra, that this person cares a lot about you. They want to be in a relationship with you. And in the near future, you will experience happiness, joy and fulfillment regarding this connection. Libra, I will leave it here. Thank you so, so very much for being with me. Please like, share and subscribe. And once again, thank you very much for your time. I truly, truly appreciate you. Libra, have a fantastic and absolutely gorgeous day. And once again, thank you very much for being with me. I am sending you much, much love. Till next time. Take care. Bye.